Hey everyone, um, so this is an impromptu clip. Um, I just thought I'd better do it. I've been telling you guys I'm going to do it. I've been, I've been telling you guys I will do it for ages. And I haven't had a chance, so I've been getting clippings for my stations um, ready for the next few days and for tomorrow. So um, I've got a few pieces of these that I'm going to pull apart for you. Um, There's probably one of the biggest things that people ask, so I'm going to show you how it's done. Um, it's pretty easy, it's pretty brutal. Bear with me, I'll make it quick. Okay, um, and it's coming on dark, so I don't really have that much time. So we have three different types of piece lily here. We've got your normal standard piece lily, as you can see, all those nodes there. Yeah, cool, great. We've got the second piece lily, which I have lost. Oh no, there it is. Okay, so this is a variegated piece lily, a domino. As you can see, the variegation is beautiful. And it's also got quite a few nodes there, as you can see. Okay. All right, and I've got a third piece lily, which I have lost. Um, actually have lost. Like really, for real, I've lost. And the only reason I brought that up was because it has, was, was flowering. So I thought, I've got these two, I'll put a flowering one in with it, make a lot more money, you know, be rich. But alas, it's not here. So instead of wasting everybody's time, let's just pull apart these two pieces of these and hopefully find a third one whilst I am doing it. All right, so can you guys see the ground? All right, what I'll do, there we go. Excuse my attire. Um, this is my, I haven't showered for three days look. Um, so I'm really glad you can't smell the screen. That's the thing, you know what I mean? Anyway, all right, so. These are our two pieces of these here. I'll quickly run and see if I can find a third. Flower and all. See? It's the only reason I wanted to do with this third one, because you had a flower, so I can mix it with the two. Create something special. Voila. Alright, so this is how you break down a piece of the lee to make to, to make a hydro plant, okay? I'm not even kidding. So you literally just loosen the soil a little bit, like so. Pull this up. <coughs> just like that. Done. So all we're going to do now. Done. Not quite, but almost. Impressive, hey. This is pretty much done. The only thing is, you're gonna have bits of dirt within these nodes, okay? So the only thing you've got to do with this piece of lily is pull the nodes apart. So to do that, is you grab a node, you find a node, all right, it's another node. You push them away from the plant and down and out, just like that, okay? So we'll do that again. Just push them out and down and out. See how there's little bits of dirt in there? Then we're going to wash them away, and then you won't have any dirt. You won't have any muck. It'll all be easy. Okay? So we'll do that again. So I'll do this, a few of these, and I'll do the next one as well, and then we can create something special really quickly. So down, away from the plant. As you can see, there's dirt within there. I would not have been able to get that dirt um, had I just kept hosing and hosing and hosing. You need to pull these apart. Okay? It's important that you pull this apart, otherwise, you're just going to you to get murky water okay so he's gone and then we'll do it again and you are going to lose a few leaves it's just the, the nature of things and look there's some already now the thing with piece of these right uh, water level is extremely important so if you're going to turn this into a hydro plant the water level cannot be above the roots okay if you if you have that water level just up here any higher than the roots you're going to lose every single leaf from there down okay it's just a matter of fact. Don't play with fire. Don't mess with me. I'm telling the truth. Okay? So ideally, just say this is what was your piece of lead. You can cut half of these roots off if, you, if the vase that you're going to put it in doesn't suit. You do you. It doesn't really matter. As long as it's got some root on there, it's fine. So basically, if I was going to put that in a container like that, you wouldn't have the water passed where my thumb is there. Okay? The water cannot go past where my thumb is there. Okay, you got that? This is very important. Very, very, very important. I really need you to listen to me on this. The water level on piece of lilies is in 
the most important part of the, the process, okay? You will lose peace of the leaf. And you'll come to me crying, and you'll ask me what, and you ask me why did I lose my piece of lean? And the first question I'll ask you is, how, where was the water level? And you'll tell me, and I'll roll my eyes, and I'll give you a new one because I feel sorry for you. But you know, yeah, moving on. So there we go. Pull it apart. See, there's more dirt. See, the, the deeper you get into those nodes, the more dirt there is. Okay. So there we go. We're almost there. Do a few more nodes, and then you'll get to the mother node. Okay. The mother node is another. Another ball game altogether. Oh, something's biting me. It's delightful. Oh. So this is the mother node here, right? So this... There you go. So that's the mother node there. So what you can either do is you can put this back in, put this into your water thing with your water pieces, or what I recommend everybody to do, and everybody who's been to a class of mine knows that this is what I recommend, so you find your scissors, which I don't have, so we're just going to do it the old school way. I'm going to rip that off, All right? And then you're going to plant that. That's going to bring you a whole new plant, okay? See that? All those little nodes there? It's a whole new plant right there. And you've still got your piece of the piece there, okay? So out of that, we put all those back together. It's probably not a bit harsh, but there we go. There we are. That'll wash us off quite nicely, easily. There we go. Nice clean pieces of piece lily. They're ready to go into to your hydro, hydro vase, whichever vase you choose. I'm just saying hydro vase because you know, that's what I'm supposed to say. Oops, what did I just do there? Do not know. Um, all right, so that's one piece lily. You want to do the other one? All right, we'll do it quickly. So this guy, this guy's been a bit through a bit of trauma, but we brought him back to life. So all we're going to do is loosen him up a little bit. <coughs> it's too much for it, and I like it. <coughs> oh, excuse me, I had anger issues. Oh, hang on now. All right. Now, you can see, this guy is more of a strapper. Can I just say the word? The strap, like the middle one word. More, more so, okay? He's a lighter version, but he's more like a Madonna Lily. And why I say that is because his nodes are much thicker than the other guy. See how there are lots of little nodes? This guy's got one big massive mother node. Mother, mother node. <laughs> mother node. Alright, so same game. Pull them all apart. Alright, blah 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 blah. I should be more delicate with this, but I just don't think that you guys really want to watch this for half an hour. All right, so there's your mother node there. Look at look at him. He's grown back before, okay? I know that for a fact because just the way that he's grown. So I'm just going to pull that. There you go. And I'm going to replant that. All right. You can put it in water. You can put it in the soil. Up to you. It's a whole new plant. It's going to regrow on you. Okay? That's two new plants that you're going to regrow. Plus you've got a whole bunch of plants to play with. So a bit of that, a bit of that, a bit more of that. And then when we do this guy, you got a bit of that. Show the green. Green. Looks spectacular, right? You want to do the green? One more? One more for good luck? Alright. So I'm just going to have to do them anyway. So, so you're watching. So loosen the soil. Now you'll be doing this over, over a proper thing with where the soil catches, okay? And pull them out of the soil. Alright, and just loosen that, just like that. Just loosen the soil away from the plant. In my case, boom, 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 boom. But hey, we're being, we're being gentle this time. And then, get the hose. The hose. The soil should come up pretty easy, as you can see. Okay. But it's not all going to come off, as you can see. I could be at this all night, and there's still a bit of soil in there, okay? You and I don't have all night. You've got wine to drink, I've got plants to, plants to make, so let's make it quick. Alright, so again, here's your piece of lily. Now, same, exact same thing here. So we're going to grab a node, okay? Grab this guy, pull him back, 
down and away. And you see the dirt in there? And then it's what we wash away. So we just my hose. And you see how that dirt's pretty much gone from there. You got a beautiful piece of pistoly that you're gonna mix with this guy and this guy. And you know what? We're gonna mix another piece of that guy. And then Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Let's go put it in something, hey? Stay with me. Let's brush my feet. I don't want to work. Yeah. Uh, dirt into my house, which I've just cleaned. I mean, that would be no no, wouldn't it? So, what vase are we going to choose? There's a perfect vase just there. All right, bear with me. And if you notice, my t shirt. His propagation station in peace of mind. The reason I'm wearing that is because the beautiful, beautiful people of peace of mind have been feeding me for the last couple of days, whether they know it or not. The chicken salad, chicken and him, chicken and bacon, sorry, salad has been absolutely delightful the last couple of days. I've been going to the fridge every every time I'm hungry. I'm just having like mouthful after mouthful after mouthful. Like honestly, the best food and there's some the soap. Oh my gosh, and the honey, oh, the honey and the um. Grace's garlic, oh my god. I saw that just came back into stock today. Anyway, enough about that. So there you go. So we have just made... How do we set it there? There you go. Look at that. We put some crystals in the bottom of there. Perfect, perfect Valentine's Day gift. Mother's Day gift. Just a gift to say I love you. Doesn't show quite... Takes a minute. Takes about a couple of hours to, you know, fully kick in, but... Oh my god, I haven't shaved in god knows how long. But anyway, you guys get the picture. You've seen them before. You've seen them in store. That's how it's made. That's how I make them. Um, any tips or tricks, just hit me up. Any questions, just hit me up. But it's as simple as that. Just pull it straight out of the thing. Smash, smash it away. And it's all about pulling those nodes away. Okay? So pull them away. So down and away. That. And you're going to... It's not going to be perfect. You're going to lose some of the, the, the roots. doesn't matter. The roots can be that long. The roots can be that long. doesn't matter. There's still root there. It'll regrow. Okay? Depends on your aesthetic and what you want to put it in. All right. I need a, I need a, I need a cold drink of Coke or something. Whew. I hope you guys learned something from that. I've been meaning to do this one for so long. Um, I hope it was cohesive. Um, yeah, it's been a while. I just thought I'd do it while I had three pieces of leaves to do it. Look at me. My arms are covered in, like... Uh, and I have so many, oh, I made this thing today too. How cool is that? And this is just some of the stations I have to put together tonight. Like when I say some, it's like one eighth. So yeah, I got a lot of work to do. All right, thank you for watching. I will see you next time. And any questions, you know how to reach us. Thanks, bye.